Hi, it's Russ from Studio One Expert, and I want to talk about recording guitar via a Universal Audio Apollo interface. It could be any of their range, but this is the Apollo Twin I'm using, and I'm going to be recording through the Fender 55 Deluxe, which is part of the plugins that you can get from Universal Audio. It's really good for getting that great guitar sound, because as you know, recording straight into a DAW uh, can be painful if you've just got an electric guitar DI'd in. So I've got this coming in. Now, the great thing is I don't need to worry about latency because console application that comes with the Universal Audio Interfaces means that it's it's almost not there. So the one thing you want to make sure of when you're using a Universal Audio Interface is that you don't have this switched on, because if you turn that on, that's the input coming into Studio One, and as you can hear, there's a bit of a delay there now, so I don't want that. So I turn that off, and I leave this one on. Now also the great thing about the Fender 55 is it's a unison enabled plugin, which means that it will respond like a guitar amp. So if I, I'm gonna get to my front pickup and then start turning the volume. So if I turn the volume control down on my guitar, you can hear the tone changes. And if I turn it further up, I'll get more grunt. And then I can just use my pickups to get this Fender 55 to work in unison mode and work like a regular amp and of course then I can also do some more stuff here just as if I was adjusting a real amp and more gain yeah I like that that's great and of course then I can balance it to the tracks so if I listen to the track with it get my monitor level right Just those pickers a bit more. Yeah, I like that. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go back to the start of the track and we're going to record a guitar part. Now a couple of things to check as well. I've also got instantiated in here the space echo give me a bit of echo. Now one thing to check when you're using any Universal Audio console application plugin is that here there's one that says U UAD record or UAD monitor. So I can either record with that effect or just monitor with it. And what that means is if I record with the, in, in monitor mode then I'll hear the echo when I'm recording but it won't be on the track so I can keep my options open. So that's a very useful option. I'm going to record with it because I want this to record as if I'm recording a real guitar in a real room. And I'm just going to check my mics as well. And we can mute one. So all the body is coming from that nice Royer. And then all the clang is coming from that 57. Just take that back a bit. Turn that down there on there, and let's let's try recording a pass. So I made a couple of mistakes there, so I'm going to go for another take. So there's the take. So let's have a listen back to what we've got now. So we've been able to record without any delay on that and then we can listen back to it now. So there we are, we've been able to record an electric guitar through a nice Fender amp without any latency and you've got that lovely unison mode where we've been able to use the amp as if it was a real amp, track it in Studio One without any delay and the track's down as if I'd tracked it in a big studio. Thanks for watching, I'll see you again soon.